Yammers, listen. You all know one of my favorite television shows is uh, is is Big Bang Theory. <laughs> you love the Bazinga. I love the Bazinga, you but you love when when Sheldon say Bazinga. And I think all the characters are so great, but my favorite character, Sheldon Ring. Sheldon Ring. Sheldon Ring. Does anybody, what do you think about uh, Sheldon Ring? Anyone? Are you? It seems like there's a lot of people in chat who are bigger fans of Young Sheldon Ring. It says everyone. Everyone likes it. Everyone likes it. Everyone likes it. I'm seeing only messages that are in support of the joke. Only positive messages that are in support of the joke. That's all I'm seeing. This is incredible. I've never seen so much positivity in the chat. All for one joke. It's amazing. Not a single negative message. It's the first joke that everyone agrees on. We don't have chat on the screen anymore. So the YouTube watchers have no way to refute this. If you're watching on YouTube, I want you to know everyone in chat is clapping and chanting Jacob over and over again. And some people are saying like that there might not ever be a better joke. That's what's happening in the chat for real. You missed it. Can I say it again? Yeah. Sheldon ring. Sheldon ring from Big Bang Theory. Big Bing Theory. Big ring theory? Anyone? Hi, everybody. <laughs> Seeing several people saying this was their first live stream and this is how it started. <laughs> Did you immediately uninstall Twitch? I was trying to think of a joke, but it wasn't working. So, you got off this time. I got off scot-free? Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Please respond to Jamie's poll in chat. What's the what's the poll? Pro Sheldon Ring, anti Sheldon Ring. I'm more of a young Sheldo. This is crazy. It's 100% pro Sheldon Ring mm -hmm. votes. Mm -hmm. This is insane. I've never seen a Twitch poll where no one even voted as a joke a different way. It's 100%. Mm -hmm. It's it's 200% Pro Sheldon wow. Ring? Really, really shooting up there. This is insane. More people voted than are in the than are here in the chat. That's wild. Pro Sheldon Ring. That's incredible. It might be one of the best jokes I've ever I've ever heard. <laughs> Julia hand actually bad this time. <laughs> it's not an engagement ring bit. It's a uh, actually a bad hand actually a bad hand. Julia's experiencing a, a, a twinge of cringe. A no, a, a twinge of tendinitis. Yeah, I have tendinitis. Which is hand. not as fun. No. I have tendinitis in my off hand. So you don't even want to know what the, the main hand is like. Destroyed. Really, the answer is that I've destroyed both my wrist joints forever. So they're very easily damaged now. Yeah. But you you should know that the, the twinge of tendinitis is from working out. That's true, yeah. Which means Julia is getting stronger. And these are some of the things that happen. These are the growing pains of getting stronger. Mm-hmm. Julia is going be, gonna to become a strength build, <laughs> just like Geraldine Slay. Uh-huh. Um, we're back in Elden Ring. And I hope you're all ready to play some Elden Ring with me today. I, I hope you're ready to see what Jacob's got cooking over here because I love this whole look right now. It's like, you know, whenever I play Smash and I um, I play as Marth, I always choose the, the whole white outfit Marth. Yeah, Wedding Marth. Yeah, Wedding Marth. Wedding love, Day Marth. I love an all white outfit because it's an outfit I will never wear. 
Look at what we got going on today. And then we got the black blades. Come on. And the gold deets. Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this shit? We're rocking the Redons today, baby. We're rocking the Redons. Uh, before stream today, I really wanted to get a um, a somber smithing stones. I got to unmute you too, which I'll do. A weapon that upgrades with somber smithing stones. Not this, that. This, no, don't touch any of that. This, this, don't touch any of that. This, Stop. This. Stop. Who's that? It's my Mr. Lee. Um, so this is my somber smithing stones weapon. I had to do a, a little bit of a respec because I had to get six or 15 intelligence, which sucks, but it's all for fun. It's for the funds. We're doing it for the funds. Um, as always, also the multiplayer password is yammers with a capital Y. Uh, if you want to join, I'm on PC. So you can join for multiplayer by putting in the multiplayer password Yammers. So in the chat, Hazel Phoenix says, I moved my family to New York on New Year's Day. Shit is awesome. All my dreams are coming true. Today's my partner's B-Day and we're eating cake and watching Fern Gully. When I, I first read Fern Gully is Firmily Guy. <laughs> <laughs> we're reading Firmily Guy. We're watching Firmily Guy. Lurky, there's a Firmily Guy. Isn't it nice when you have those moments where you're like, damn, actually stuff for me pretty, pretty nice right now. And it's the, it's the little things. Pretty good ATM. Um, okay. So first place I'm going to be summoning for is going to be over here ish where we're going to fight the draconic tree sentinel outside of the, uh, entrance to lane Dell. So meet me over there, but we're not going there straight away. That's just going to be our next summoning destination. First, we're going to go up up to the northeast because there's another grace up there we want to hit. And then um, I'm going to go ahead and say it now for you, chat, so you know. What the hell is happening to this uh, guy? There's a gargoyle coming. Don't worry about that. It's with the shadow. It's the shadow of uh, the Empire oh. from Star Wars. Damn. Ooh, Nathan Red. Nathan Red. Nathan, Nathan Red. Red. Nathan Red. Nathan Red. Um, I just want to look at my. Oh my God, I forgot to tell you. My map. So th this little guy here is about to transform into Margit. I actually what? don't want to go. Go near him. I think I want to go this way. Uh, what did you forget to tell me? Well, I was at the grocery store. They were playing a song. Oh, it was at CBS actually. They were playing a song where two people were Boing. singing like a high pitched harmony at the same time, but one person was like half a note off and it was unbearable. Oh no. It was truly, and it the note was held for way too long. And I was like, I said out loud, oh my God, this is terrible. <laughs> at least they committed to it. You know, you gotta, you gotta sing with confidence no matter what. That's very important. Ozzy Belafron says, I got engaged today. Congratulations. Yo, get engaged. Uh, I know there's like a, there's like a grace somewhere around here. I would like to locate it if at all possible. What's that? A little golden rune action? Yeah. Why not? Where's the grace? Where's the grace? Where? No. It's not there. Upper, it's in the top left corner of this area near the shack. Top, oh, over here. Perfect. Thank you. Near the Fox shack. House. Thank you. Oh, what was I gonna say for chat? Um. Yeah, this is really important, actually, right after I rested this grace. I need, chat, I need you to get ready your, um, your, like, cold water to, like, cool yourself off. Or, like, your, your, you know, your bonking hammer to, like, dehorny yourselves. Oh. Because we're going to be seeing 
very soon a character that you're all notoriously horny for. Is it? Is and it so I just need you to be ready. I don't he? want to, I don't want you to go crazy when you see him. Okay, hold on. I need something to fan myself off. Get a, get a fan, get something. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. And I, I don't want to spoil too much, but he's done something that makes him even more attractive than before. Petty crimes? Not petty crimes. He's, he's made a change. Donated to uh, some organizations that can make a difference in the world? You could say that. In a sense. Petty crimes that then feeds the donations to good organizations that are. You're just help talking about Robin around? Hood, dude. Robin Hood You're is. You're just hot. thinking about Robin Hood. <laughs> I just heard Joy go. <laughs> Alright, get get ready everybody. Everybody be calm. Don't freak out when you see him, alright? Here he is. Okay, here he is, everybody. Calm down. Everybody, calm down. Start fanning. This time, he's cooking crab. This time, he's cooking crab. Here he is, but this time, he's cooking crab. Okay. All right, I'm going to talk to him. Everybody, everybody be cool, okay? Be cool. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What are you looking at? Oh, you again, is it? Perfect bloody timing, Ashley. I got crab cooked up fresh. <laughs> Get you a man that can cook. Just saw a big awooga in chat. <laughs> Get you a man who can cook crab. And see, now we can buy boiled crab from him. Damn. That man's got it all. But more importantly, he has something he wants us to know about. So everybody, open your ears. Please listen. I will always listen to him. This is important. Bye. There's something I should probably tell you. You heard of the Dung Eater? He's a madman. Has it out for everyone. Curses him. Goes round in his rank armor and all. You see him though. Stay well away. I was in the same jail as him once, so I know first hand. He's a god forsaken monster. Not just some petty dog like me. He knows the poo poo man. He knows the poo poo man. He shared a cell with the poo poo man. Tell us more about the poo poo man. He's a killer. Kills people and curses the souls. Does all sorts of shit to the corpses to keep them cursed forever. I ain't seen nothing more disgusting in all my years. The man has I've morals. I've never been more scared neither. Rooted to the bloody spot while he did that to my friend. He lost a friend to the poo-poo man. That right there is reason enough. Reason enough to take out the poo-poo man. These crabs are like, boy, I hope he catches me. <laughs> oh boy. They're like, uh-oh, don't get me. Uh-oh, <laughs> no. It would be so bad if you were to catch me and cook me. <laughs> oh no, please crab man, don't get me. Oh. Even the crabs. All right, so up here somewhere, we're gonna we're gonna summon people. I didn't. I just take this freaking thing away. Where's the freaking? What's the freaking? I just took this freaking thing away. Did you water your guy? Yeah. Why is there little white stuffs coming off the bottom of your guy? What are you talking about? You see those little like rocks? That's drips of water. Oh my god! <laughs> it's just drips of water on a plant, Julia. What? It's not rocks. <laughs> It's like the opposite of rocks. <laughs> Get a hold of yourself. Are we going through with the Poo Poo Man's quest considering the tragedy that entails its completion? We are. It's truly a high. We will be doing the Poo Poo Man's quest. Poo Poo Man's quest. Not to full completion because it involves getting like the worst ending in the game. Mm. The Poo Poo ending. Mm. 
Giants. Don't, don't. Ooh, dude. Dude's got athlete's foot over dude, there. Dude, don't. Bro, don't. Bro. Bro, don't. Bro. <laughs> Bro, don't. Come on. Bro. Bro, don't. Don't do it. Dude. I'm gonna freaking kill him. He's a dead man. I can do this. He yeah! <laughs> he yeah! Do you guys want to know a cool fact about the Achilles tendon? Behind the Achilles tendon is a sack of fat. And it looks like kind of salmon row. You came for me, bro. This is what happens. Damn. Those things look so much like the Guardians in Breath of the Wild. The Guardians of the Galaxy? Yeah. Yeah, we went to our friend's place for New Year's Eve and he has this anatomical foot model. Mm -hmm. uh, and we were examining the parts of the foot. And you can remove the Achilles tendon and behind it you find a little fat pad. She's right. Okay, right here next to the summoning pool. This is where we're going to summon. So everyone come to the summoning pool area. If you want to get summoned to fight this, this draconic tree sentinel right and, here. And as uh, Jamie has said, the password is Yammers. Oh, is this, is this an NPC summon? Oh, it is. It's, it's Tregoth. Great oh, horned Tregoth. Tregoth. We're not going to be using you today. Well, what are you doing? Are you sneaking? A little sneaking ghost over there. <laughs> oh, who we got right here? Oh, they're using that my my favorite looking sword in the game. Oh, it is cool. The Murray Executioner. I I'm such a sucker for a sword with like a flat end for some reason. Yeah. It's like my favorite sword aesthetic. So Sigrid Bramble. Also, your character looks cool as hell. Yeah. What the hell? Sigrid Bramble, get in here. It's like the uh, soul bad guy sword. It is like the soul bad guy sword. I love it. It's a big butter knife. Yeah, basically. The good thing about these weapons mm -hmm. is that technically it's just one weapon that when you two hand it, it's two of them. So I can still do this yeah. while holding them. Yes, Sigrid! Yes, 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 yes. Let's go! We know someone named Sigrid. We do, in real life. Oh, you're becoming Egg. Yes, Egg. Oh, there's another sign right under you. Who? Who? Lily. Lily! Hello, oh, Lily. Lily! It's ladies night. It's ladies night in the Draconic Tree Sentinel jurisdiction. Was someone asking about these statues? This is the, the summoning pool. So you can like activate this and then you can like get summoned in to places if, even if you're not like there in person. Lily. Lily, come on Lily. Lily. Hello Lily. Hello Lily. Oh no. Oh God, what's happening? Oh, I think it just did the thing. Why? Where you gotta tab back to the why did it do it? Why did it do it? Didn't you change something for another game we were playing and streaming? I didn't change anything. I changed it back. Oh. I changed it back. My thing, my thing blipped. I can't read chat anymore. I gotcha. Why did it blip? It hasn't blipped in so long. It hasn't. I'm so bummed out by this. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Sigrid. I appreciate that. That means a lot to me. Oh my god, that's right, I have a new phone. I'm gonna have to fight without the aid of chat. I'm not even gonna know if chat's having fun. I'm not gonna know if chat's enjoying the fight. I don't remember. Alright, let me chug a lug this. Y'all ready, gamers? We're gonna do a, um... We're gonna do it. We're gonna do a flame, grant me strength. We're gonna do a little drinky drink. And we're going in. What's up, a-hole? Yeah! You're not hitting me, dude. 
All right, you hit me a little bit. All right, you hit me like a lot, actually. How you like this? Kaboom! Kaboom! Don't lightning me, bro. This dude hits so damn hard. Don't. Oh my god. He one shot me. <laughs> he oh one shot me, y'all. Oh my god. Bad news, everyone. He one shot me. I can't even read. I can't even read the chat. You can't even read the Fs in the chat. I can't even read the Fs. But I know they're there. I know they're coming. I'm not adept with this weapon yet, okay? All right. We're going to summon back up. Same spot. Apologies to... Um, oh, I can read the chat again. Nice. Oh, cool. Because I'm signed out on Twitch on my phone. Apologies to Lily and to Sigrid. They, they did admirably and I was the one who dropped the ball. I, I was the fool. Kara? Kara? We've summoned Kara Kara before, right? K-Ray? I don't remember so I'm summoning again. Okay. Kermit <gasps> the Frog! For me. We win. We win the game. Game one. Did I miss talking to Millicent earlier? No, I haven't talked to Millicent yet. Oh my Kermit God. the Frog. Hey. What? Hey. How come you could say hey? Hey. Why did Kermit have such a normal voice? Hey. All right, Kara died, I guess. So we're going to summon yogurt popsicles instead. <laughs> Kermit and yogurt popsicles. With this team? What would you we like ain't losing with this team. What would you like for breakfast? Yogurt. Yogurt popsicles. Yo, good! Hey! Nice swords! This right. is a beautiful team. I oh. love Yogurt's outfit. I'm gonna wait for your move to finish. I'm gonna wait oh, for both you. of your moves to finish. Thank you. You know what? You gotta let, do it. Let me, let me get in on that too, actually. I can't see two people do it and not do it with them. Hello, Miss Olive. All right, we got this squad. I started playing a uh, cultist simulator on my phone and I'm the most confused I've ever been playing a game, but there was a lot of erudition. You got some erudition? There was a lot of erudition in that game. Oh, they're OP. They're OP. Damn, got blasted in the face. All right, we gotta we gotta play it cool. The lightning bolt move really sucks. I'm just gonna snag those. Eat shit! Oh, you're done. You're freaking donezo, dude. I got the four paws leap. I got the four paws leap. Yes, gamers, you're blowing my mind. Yes. Beautiful squad. Yes, squad. Thank you, Kermit and Yogurt Popsicles. Beautiful. Okay. Now that that's done. You're a good old cat. You're a freaking cool cat. I just want to say, I don't know if this stream is cursed or something. But just like looking at the, the watching the chat this whole time, mm -hmm. I've seen like three instances now where someone has typo accidentally typoed a racial slur that has gotten auto modded. Really? Yeah, like it's really obvious the accidental mistake oh. they made, but I keep seeing it in the auto mod, and I'm like, oh no, how does this keep happening? 
I'm just gonna touch a little grace. Thank God for the auto mod. It's like clearly unintentional and very funny that it's happened like twice. And <laughs> Draz just put a smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> it's extremely unfortunate. All right, we need a little vigor, and I'm gonna I'm gonna pop some juice because we're so we're so few runes away from another level. We're gonna juice a bit. Don't tell anyone that, that I'm juicing. Whoa, man! Not in front of the kids. Don't tell the kids that I'm juicing a bit. My worst fear is it doing exactly that. <laughs> Today, while at the um, while at the hardware store, I asked a dude to show me where like the um, the rubber pipes were or the rubber tubes because I needed to make like a funnel contraption. And um, instead of saying drip, I said lick to this man, and I was like, "How did I?" <laughs> oh no! I was like, "Come on." Don't say lick to the man I know, at the I hardware like, I store. Just said lick to this complete stranger. I'm sorry, dude. I think it's because like there was a song that was on. I I honestly am not sure what was happening. Oh, ads. Advertisements. Then let us read from the tome of subscribers. Let us read. We've received subs from Squash Peddler 41, Clarissa 89, Kate Dice, Mad Dr. Dan, Ebola Jello, Maxinaxum, Urgle Gurgle, Hash the Baker, Tonka Tuff Badonka Donk, The Elderberry, Professor Rad gave out five gifted subs, Lady Sleepless Gaming, Disaster Frog, Stellar Sorcerer, Honey Bats, Gay Dread Knight, Lightning Leonine. Leonine. Please draw Watsune Miku gave out five gifted subs. Eldritch Floof, Dyson Cube, Two Dummy Thick, Tooth Decay, Depressy Bessie, Rutabug, Scud of Scuds, Librarian 2, The Appendix gave out five gifted subs. The Queer Lawyer, Slorts, Impeccable Vibes Only, Science Side, The <laughs> Thomas, not The Mass, Thomas the Turbo Brick, Ides of Starch, Dr. Plant, Egg Woman, Skippy Gator, Vor, oh whoa, Dark Cosmic Kata, Rady K gave out 10 gifted subs. Puppy Pwobs, The Music Man 08, Dark the Bat. Puppy Pwobs gave out 10 gifted subs. I am Beth F, Star Kindled, Magnolia, Super Bedwards gave out 10 gifted subs. What's going on today, man? This Sub City, thank you all so much. Wowee. Uh, Kaiju King J, Spunky Tank, Star Kindled, Hannah Na, The Juice Box, The Second Reckoning, Gee Weena, With Wherewithal, Today is Football, Blind Willie Steve, Mooneybug, Punch Frog, Rohanology, Cluster Funks gave out five gifted subs. A Snow Pig, Kate Kate, Cassowary Kick, League Nuyella, Angel Tazzy, Evelyn Sometimes, JT Barnett, Imagine Birds, Look an Elephant, Lemon Giraffe, Tabasco Cat, Arcteal Games, Gorilla Boy, Pyropia123, Unbelievable, Keyboard, Bubble Blowing Booba, Pepper Molin 15, Read Marks Dammit, One Entire Pancake Weasel, Roomful of Lesbian Vampires gave out two gifted subs. And let's go back to the top. See who else got in here. Looks like it was Fine Sunny Day and Itty Bitty Witty and Rug Fern. Thank you all very much for all the subs. Can I show you an unfortunate <clears throat> discovery I've just made? Yeah. As we're still in ads. Yeah. The top of Olive's head looks like Slender Man in a forest. There's like the head. There's like the shoulders, his little suit. There's the trees. I kind of see what you mean a little bit. There's like an eyeball, eyeball. Yeah. Slender Man real? Slender Man real and it's on Olive's head? You got a little Slender Man on there? You got a little Slender Man. You got a little Slender Man. Do you think if I like refresh the scene, it'll... Absolutely mm, not. No. Can you like close the preview and open the preview? I don't think I can close the preview. Mm. Well. See if I do like a... Uh... Is the scene switching for y'all? Is it switching between webcam and gameplay when I do that? 
Uh, for my us, my stream happening. labs is like frozen. So I'm just trying to see like what's working and what's not. But the chat's working, which is It weird. is switching. Okay. Uh -huh. Well, that's fine then. As long as you can see it, that's what really matters. All right, shall we get back to the game? Yeah. Um, okay, so... Ooh, there's a person. Who the heck? Who are you? It's Vaughn Lightwraith! Whoa! They're back. Um, I probably am going to summon in this little area here momentarily. Uh, because we're basically only here right now to listen to a loud motorcycle go by. Mm -hmm. We're basically only here right now to pick up um, a certain item and then some of the um, sites of grace so we can warp to them later. But cool view ahead. Content warning, cool view. Mm. We get our first look here coming up at Landell Royal Capital and the Erd Tree. Big tree. We're actually at the Erd Tree. We're Ert the Erd Tree. Erd Tree wearing that high slit dress. Yeah, sure is. And I believe this is where Melina takes her leave from us. We're about to be maidenless again. Whoa. Congrats on the divorce. Congrats on the divorce. <laughs> yep, here she is. My utmost thanks for bringing me to the base of the Erd Tree. Here, I can govern my own movement, and thus, the accord is fulfilled. I shall depart to ascertain the purpose I was given. Farewell. I shall leave Torrent and the power to turn Man, it would suck if she took Torrent. And the power to turn runes into strength. Yeah. Runes into strength. You, yeah. You're done you leveling up and you have no horse. Your ambition. You have fought long Enjoy walking. I have no doubt. I'm bankrupting you, you and repossessing Elden your Lord. car. May you take the throne. Thank you. Thank you, Melina. It's a cool room you're in. Love the tapestries. Oh, Bach is here too. <gasps> Bach! Um, we're still not ready to talk to Bach. You have to be ready to talk to Bach. So here's the thing about Bach. Bach doesn't uh, like himself. Relatable feeling. Yeah. And Bach is looking for a way to uh, to transform himself into something else. And we have the means to do that in terms of the... Uh, the larval tier that we have, but we can't give it to him because it will make him meet with a uh, unfortunate fate. So we have to wait later. Wait till later and then we can give Bach what he truly needs. Which is therapy. <clears throat> Which is therapy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna summon up and then we're gonna go and get some things. Ronnie! I said at the thing instead of doing the thing. Sarkon. Sarkon. And Tiramisu. Hey, cute. Tiramisu. <laughs> Put some runes into therapy. Hey. <laughs> Bach is not gonna trans he gender. Bach is gonna learn to practice radical self acceptance. Eventually. Let's go! Let's go! All right, gamers. Let's do it. Uh, this area is very big and very confusing. Also, cool view ahead. Content warning. Content warning, one of the coolest show views. The dragon. I'm going to show the dragon. Shit is so sick. <laughs> They're spinning. <laughs> yeah, it's a cool view. It uh, look a little bit like Italy. <laughs> did I just say the name of an Italian dessert in a French accent? Yeah. Yeah. I did. They say it in France, too. It look a little bit like Italy. This looks like Italy? It look... This looks like Italy? <laughs> like a little bit... That look like the olive tree. 
The ol what? <laughs> the olive tree. Oh, and the, the Frick Italian off. tutors outside. The tutors. <laughs> we do not accept the tutors. Oh, uh, the famous Italian tutors. All tutors must die. We're oh, where are you going, bud? One the fungus. You're not getting away. You thought you could toot? You can't toot. Um, what I was gonna say before we were looking at the cool view. Oh yeah, this giant who does the big spit. Get him, Sarkon! I don't think it reached. What the heck? Oh, it just wasn't. Okay. We're going in. Italian Julie versus French Jacob, whoever wins, we lose. Do, do, do. He, aww. Wow. You killed it before I, I got to slam. Toot. Who tooted? Who's tooting? Who's tooting? Hey! Hey! You in there tooting? Who's tooting? Oh, this place is like a millennial's dream. I know, right? Plants everywhere. Plants, wood. This is where There's the um, the court perfumers make their vile poisons. Fuck! Fuck. My screen did the thing again! Why? I don't understand. I thought I had this fixed. Maybe I booted things up in the wrong order or something. I don't know, you, you also have Clip Studio open. I don't know if that's doing anything. Clip Studio doesn't care. Clip Studio don't care. Invaded! Recusant Cat Waifu. Wait, we've Wait, summoned Cat, cat waifu. waifu. You used to be a friend. This is a betrayal. We'll, we'll await you in the perfumer's house, cat waifu. Meet us in the perfumer's house for an ass beating. Oh, oh hello. Are we supposed to follow cat waifu or does cat waifu want to fight? What are we doing? Friend? <laughs> Friend? The battle's on. Are we, fo are we following? What are we doing, cat waifu? Are we fighting? Oh, that was a friendly crouch. Wow, a little healing orb. Thank you, cat waifu. <laughs> Are you here to help? Wow. I don't really think you can help. But but hello. Let me uh we'll give you give you one of these. I wish I could read chat. They're probably having fun. I hate it when I go chat blind. <laughs> yeah. Little cave moss for me? What the heck? What's going on out here? Cat waifu. Cat waifu. Did you send the elevator? We need that. We need, excuse me. We need the elevator, cat waifu. You can't send it. A scamp. We gotta go down on that. Excuse me? You heard me. All right, come on everybody. So we gotta get up in there, up in that room that was dead ahead. That's where the first item we need is. Yeah! Yeah! We're going up the, la the ladder. We're running up that hill. Oh, I can read chat again. They're mad at me for something. I think they're mad at me for saying going down on that. We gotta come up here and we gotta get this. The seed bed curse continues. Oh, I'm kind of. Oh, well, sorry, bud. I didn't. Sorry for the collarbones. Listen, this was completely accidental. I didn't mean to. I'm really, listen, I didn't, I'm sorry. And then there's a window we're gonna jump out of. Can't be that window. I'm trying to remember which window it is. is it I this guess window? now we just get this invader music the whole time, huh? Oh, it went away. The second I brought it up. I think it is this window. Is it this window? Yeah.
Yeah. Maybe we go down first. It's this way. This is safer. Yeah. This makes more sense than what I was doing. I love these roofs. I know the golden oh, roofs. Hello. The what golden roofs. What is this? What are you doing? Howdy, partner. Damn, trying to hide. You can't hide from me. Don't throw. No throwing. Oh my God, some lightning around here, huh? What? Okay, only pet face. Lightning crashes. Only Okay, we're going to the Avenue Balcony site of Grace, which I believe is down this way. Hello. Over the river and through the woods. Hi. To the Avenue Balcony we go. I can't pet you with this hand, Olive. We're touching Grace. You go, you're trying to get up? <laughs> you idiot. What's she doing? She couldn't get purchased, so her right leg was just all the way out with all of her toes splayed. Like, eh. Whee. All right, next we want to get to the West Capitol Rampart, which I know is this way. Ready to watch me juke him? Like Justin? Whoa. Nice. Whoa. Nice try. Damn. That guy's got a thick bow. Dude's got thick HP. Ah! Ow! Bro. I really do love how this How you like looks. this? Welcome to Earth. Wow, damn. I didn't mean to do it again. That one was just for fun. Where is the next summon spot? I really want to show Julian my character, LOL. The next summon spot, I think, might be the sewers? I think we go up the dragon, right? Isn't this how we get to the West Capitol Ramparts site of Grace? This area took me so long mm -hmm. on my first playthrough. Sure did. Well, we had no idea where we were going. Yeah, I didn't even think about going up the dragon. No. Because I was like, this is a video game. I can't go up the dragon. That's just there for show. Then I remembered it's not just a video game. Mm -hmm. It's Elden Ring. Running up that gone. <laughs> and then somewhere up here beneath the pale moonlight. Oop, I'm sneaking. He knows. It doesn't matter, not with this squad. Get his ass. Get a little gravel stone. A little gravel stone treat. Where's the grace? Oh, God! Nice dodge. Thank you, my instincts. There's the grace. All right, this is where I must say goodbye to Tiramisu and Sarkhan. Thank you both. Thank you. So much for your service. I'm going to hit you with one of these. Sarkhan just ran away. Sarkhan, oh, you, you can't run from fate, my friend. A woo. You guys just wrote out a woo. A woo? There's an O and then you're oh, kind of a oh, W. Oh, I see, I see. Had an o. Hey. Hey. Oh, and, and Cat. Cat is still here. <laughs> Goodbye. 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 Cat, thank you for leaving of your own accord. I appreciate it. <laughs> I thought Cat was gone. So did I. What is it, Miss Olive? I'm so close to another level. I might have to juice a little more. Juice, man. Don't tell anyone that I'm juicing, please. It's just a little what bit of juice. It? It's just a little, a little, a little tittle bit of juice. I stopped petting Olive because she started licking her orange, and when I stopped petting her, she was like, "She likes to lick the orange while you pet her." Gonna, we clearly need more vigor right now at this juncture. Why? Because you got one shot. <laughs> Since by I got boss one on shot horse. by that boss, yeah. Oh, hello. Whoa. Um. Now this this guy's bonks. That yeah. 
Chief bonks here. Essence of bonks. Uh, but for now, we have to go back to round table hold. Because there is um, a visitor here. Oh. That we're not gonna like. I think actually uh, Roderico will tell us about him. Madam Rana, I need to do better than this. This will never kill a god. I can do better than this. It needs to slay a bloody god. Listen, perfection is not achievable. Listen, my friend, I, pr I promise you, we're gonna slay a god. Do you see oh, this face? It's you. We're, we're gonna get there. I never noticed he had so many teeth hanging out. Just lay out your arms. He's a toothy lad. He looks like one of those Yorkie dogs. Roderica, tell us what's been going on. Greetings. Are you here for spirit tuning? What, what should I know, Roderica? Tell me. Tell us a I cool need fact. To warn you about something. Oh. A little while ago, someone started lurking in the wing on the opposite side of the round table. Oh. And I can hear, from all the way over there, Ooh. the howling and wailing of spirits in fear of a curse. I can even hear the repulsive twisted malice in itself. A plethora of spirits in an unceasing cacophony. I can't even imagine. How much suffering inflicted to who knows how many souls. Not even the grafting caused anything like this to happen. You should keep your distance. I know you're strong, but please. Is it a poo poo man? Is it I a big poo poo man? I can hear it from across the wing, past the round table. The howling and wailing of spirit. You should keep. Yeah, we, we should we get got with it. <clears throat> with prawn man. I feel like they'd balance each other out well. You think and they it would both be hate poo -poo man. like an opposites attract sort of thing? Yeah. They could bond over mutual well, hatred of Poo-Poo like, Man? Prawn Man has, has his morals, his standards. He's not like a total villain. He's just kind of a little scamp. And she needs a little scamp in her life. You're not wrong. You know? And he needs he needs someone someone good. Poo-Poo Man? What, why are there so many bodies in here? Poop a man throwing, uh, throwing these body parts around like they chicken wing bones. Have you ever felt the curse with your whole being? Sometimes I feel that way. upon life itself, feared and despised by all. The reviled blessing. <laughs> Apparently not. You are but a lamb. A stranger to defile and ignorant of your own ignorance. You no longer interest me. I've been long without peace. Don't spoil my quietude. No. Wait. You have felt the curse. I can smell it on you. The box, yet tender. Apparently my Chicken seat tender? is ripe and waiting. It was a brief respite, I must say. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. Thank you. Thank you for the sewer. I can kill you jail. And defile your corpse. Okay. Then All right. The pox will truly be your own. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. If you go near Roderico, we will kiss, you, kiss your ass. Kiss your ass. We'll kick your ass. Flesh. Trapped in this We're not going to kiss his ass, Julia. Look at you ass. Although I don't know which he would like more. That's true. He probably enjoys getting his ass beat. Yeah, he's probably into that. And now we have one more person to speak to before we leave. It is... Corin. Oh, God, this loser. Ah, I have been waiting for your return. I've decided to leave the round table hold. I'm off in search of a noble scholar known as the Gold Mask to beg his instruction. We may not meet again for some time. Okay. If there's any incantations you wish to learn, there's not. Now's the moment. I can learn them from the turtle. Do you see our giant swords? The golden order shines through you. <laughs> Do you see it? 
Do you think we're interested in Do you your see little it? words? Is it close enough to you? Do you need to see it closer? <laughs> I've decided to leave. There is a poo-poo man here. <laughs> <laughs> I've decided to take my studies elsewhere. I just don't want to be near the poo-poo man. You understand, right? You don't want to be near the poo-poo man either, do you? All right, now we're going uh, back. To Jacob. She doing little snores? She's asleep on her orange. No, oh, she's so cute. She's snoring. She's so cute. We're going back to the West Capitol Rampart and we have to go down to the Swars, the Swars. Um, I guess I should probably summon yeah. for this, just to make it a little easier. I'm gonna summon next to this Grace. Oh, but didn't someone say that there's like a, uh, there's like a green fog right before the sewers? then I won't summon. The problem is I don't remember exactly where I need to go. Also, I can't see anything. Give me this. Give me that cane sword. Couple of little, little, toot, little toots. No tooting. There's that fungus that's like the white puffball fungus. Or am I thinking of those spider's eggs? The fungus among us? I think I'm thinking of spider's eggs. Is it down there? Get out of here. Damn. What's this lever do? Opens up the gate. You gotta go back down the dragon. Is Julia planning on taking on Bloodborne at some point? I think so. I think I'd like to. If it ever came to PC... If it ever came to PC, I'd love to. That would make a make a big help. You little dickhead. This fella. I'm taking you out, partner. El Kabong. <laughs> you missed it. Damn, that's I, a lot of blood. I kabonged him off the cliff. You're over here sending textual messages. No, I'm to, Googling. To God knows who. I'm Googling puffball mushroom. I'm not thinking of puffball mushrooms. I think I'm thinking of tiny spider eggs. She's sending textual messages, y'all. I can't even go back down the dragon. Does it make more sense to come from the other way? I feel like I'm about to fall to my death. I feel like I should go from here. I feel like this makes more sense. The name of the armor set I'm using, I can, I can show you, I can tell you. It's the Banished Knight Armor. You get it from the Banished Knights if you farm them. Have you tried knocking one off a cliff and then getting it in a very lucky and rare drop? No, that's a that's more of a you move. <laughs> okay, there's some sewers down there. I gotta get to like the well. That's what I don't remember how to do because I'm. I'll keep of, an eye on that. Because of my brain. To sewers from West Capitol. Oh, I gotta Capitol. go like oh, over here, right? Is that what oh, you're yeah, this, for? this is the right way. Okay. I know where I'm going now. Okay. It's like right over here, somewhere. 
The well is... Eee. Stop it. The well is around here somewhere. Oh, God! Time for this. Welcome to hell. You've been bonked. There's a grace over there. I feel like I, I mean, I may as well. After all, why shouldn't I? Oh yeah, here's the, the Lionel set of armor, as well as the deathbed dress. I was about to say, this looks like Fia's setup. Yeah, there was clearly a deathbed person here doing their deathbed business with, with Lionel. Or Lionel. Oh! Isn't that what he says in Thundercats or whatever? He does say that. All right, I don't want to fight you. I'm just looking for this. I'm just, no, I'm just, no, I, no, sir, sir. I'm just looking for the sewers. Get fucking toasted, me. I didn't realize the fire stayed on the ground. I got to go back to the other grace. The well's like right under Grand Sax. Yeah, I thought so. I just always get lost in this area. It is pretty big and sprawling. At least we went ahead and got this site of grace. Yeah. You're not going to get your stuff back? I had like 5k souls. Oh, okay. Not important. All right, so we went around here. Around here. Bring it around town. No, dude, I don't... Come on, I don't want to! Stop, I just... Why, but he's so pretty. Oh, no. Yoink. Huh. Here's the well. Found that was it. easy. Excuse me. Just gonna... Take a little sippy. Bye, y'all. God damn it! Come, come on! Why is it flickering so much today? What did I do? What did I do wrong? This is very upsetting to me. Yeah. I thought I had this shit fixed. It worked perfectly the last two streams, and now it's the same, but it's not working. Why? I don't know. <sighs> I wonder if it has to do with like the game capture versus display capture. Because I had to turn on display capture because game capture wasn't picking it up. Mm. I wonder if it's something to do with that. I genuinely don't remember. Not don't remember, I don't know. I just don't like computers anymore. What's up, gamers? Anyone got a problem? There's so many rats. And then I can't even read the chat. I know. It's like, what am I even doing? Am I alone? Can anyone even see me? There's no wrong man. Subterranean shunning grounds. Oh God. Oh boy, big boy. All right, I know there's a grace. Please. There's a grace like right over here somewhere that I need to get. There it is. And then I can die in peace if I need to. Ah! Nope, I'm sitting. I'm sitting. You can't get me. Can't touch me. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. 
All right, so I think I go this way and then I drop in the hole. He's got such itty bitty legs. And a round thing in your face. Oh. And then we go. Oh, here it is. Chat's refreshing. Chat's back. Come on, man. Freaking rats, are you kidding me? Stop! That's it. Well, you got the grace. I'm not having fun. I'm not happy. I'm not pleased. I'm not thriving. I'm not moisturized. I have a cute orange kitty. We're not doing the sewers yet, so don't worry. We're just coming down here to progress the Dung Eater quest line, that's all. We gotta go past the- Ah! Oh, oh god! Oh god. god. <laughs> don't They're do spitting. it. They spitting! Don't do it. There's so much garbage down here. Don't do it. What is this, New York City subway? We're just gonna hit a little flame cleanse me, no problem. And then we can go visit our good friend, the poo poo. Oh no, I forgot. I did see <laughs> oh, God. the wear hand in let all Let me caps. in, let me in, bro. Let me out, let me out of here. I forgot. <laughs> Everything that matters to you for generations to come. Dude. I am the dung eater. A scourge upon the living. Sort of a situation. <laughs> so much of the lands too. Sort of a situation going on here. Dung eater not paying attention. I'm gonna talk to him through the wall here. When you're too enraptured in your own garbage to see all the other garbage. Leave your jail! I've been here long enough. I will kill again. And defile each corpse with care. Mm -hmm. Just to be sure that when they're reborn, they'll be cursed. Along with their children and their children's children. For all time to come. Why would your body being messed with after your death result in your curse? Like, you don't have any control over that. I will kill again just to be hell be good. Because in this game, in this world, they're supposed to return to the roots of the Erd tree and then be reborn. And so he's positing that by defiling the corpses, they'll be reborn cursed. Ah. That's what his thesis posits. Okay. Uh, we got the dung eater. Now, are you done talking by the way? Yeah, you're done talking. Hand, it was, it was fun hanging out with you. We are gonna leave. How did he get there? Who put him there? Somebody who had their head on their shoulders in the right, in the right way. Yeah. Someone looked at that man and was like, no, straight to jail. Yeah. We gotta put this dude right in prison. And then outside your jail, a lot of hands. Now we go back to visit the Dung Eater's spirit and what do we find? A message. Spirit. I'll defile you next. Come to the outer moat. Damn. <laughs> Come to the outer moat for a defiling. Bring your lunch money. But wait, isn't the outer moat where Bogart was? Humphrey? No, the crab man. I'm trying to build dramatic tension. <laughs> I forgot his name was Bogart. How could you? I only think of him as prawn man. That's how New Yorkers label everyone. You're the bodega guy. His name is Blaggard Bogart. You're the deli guy. 
I know a guy. I got a prong guy. Now he sells crabs. Prawn man. We have to go and rescue the prawn man. After all, he was in the jail with the dung eater. They got history. Damn. They know each other. I don't really want to deal with um all that. With all that. Don't worry, he's clearing trees Minecraft style. Got a regular Minecraft Steve over here. Where am I going? This way. Come together. You freaking asshole. Run, I'm riding away from you. Can why did me crap? why did Prawn Man make you think of come together? Prawn man. He's okay. Is everything okay? He's okay. All right, mate. Want some more crap, do you? About the dung eater. Yeah. And now I've seen it here again. Never thought I would. What he does to those bodies. It was... It was him. No question. That monster. He's lurking round here. You got anything else to say? All right. We're going to reload. Ooh. She reaching. Hi, thanks. Thanks for the touch. You going to go back to sleep? I rearranged everything so that I could provide you a better sleeping spot. Prawn man! <gasps> Prawn man got got? <laughs> Serves me right. What the hell? Fitting bloody end. For a jump top little shit. With big ideas. No! Help me help. Would you, mate? I don't want to get cursed. <laughs> Just let me die. Give him a crab. One last crab. I don't to the live road. Like this. Not anymore. So, please. This little crab trio, like the three ladies in Beauty and the Beast. What the hell? R.I.P. Prawn Man. Jacob. We have to get it, get our vengeance. We cannot let this stand. I will kill you. Prawn Man. Oh, I forgot about the crab! No! The crab, we didn't eat you, please! Crab, bro. Bro. Got his ass. That's so many crabs. And the crab. <laughs> Took his damn sword and everything. This posits... The question one of my favorite movies posits, which is if you knew someone was going to die, would you choose to meet them and love them? And you've, you've forced me to have to meet and love Prawn Man only to watch him die. You can play it so that Prawn Man doesn't die. But, um... <clears throat> What's the cost? It's basically just like, because of the way I'm playing, we're trying to see like all of the quest lines that we can. Mm -hmm. And that's how his quest line ends. So the alternative is he just like sits here selling crab forever and never says anything of interest ever again. He would have been happy. Then I don't know. I don't know if that's a fate worse than death. Okay. He been happy Stuck in a stasis. Lie. 
<laughs> revive him right now. <laughs> we had to complete the arc of Prawn Man. I'm sorry, everyone. I know it's difficult. I know it's difficult to accept the loss. <laughs> oh, to be sitting and selling crab in stasis. Sorry, I have to don his mask. You're right. It's only right. I'm going to have to take off some armor <laughs> in order to do it. <laughs> it's a heavy load. Nice, you're poised. Oh. Nice, you're poised. I have to... For prawn man. For prawn man. Can I put on... What's the heaviest thing I can put? I can put on all of this. None of this. Can we wear the deathbed dress? <laughs> <laughs> For you, prawn man. <laughs> For you, prawn man. Prawn Do you man. have slippies on? Oh, no, it's your duck feet. It's my duck feet. feet. I am the prawn bride. <laughs> can I fit? Oh, I could fit some of this on, maybe. The Prawn Bride. Rise of the Prawn Bride! Damn, you got a strong back. Yeah, to hold these blades? Yeah, that's true. You gotta, you must. The Prawn Widow rises. <laughs> <laughs> What's like the peak fashion we can do? I mean, obviously these. Yeah. What about the twin gauntlets? Those look kind of nice. Those are kind of cool, yeah. If I wear these, I'll have like no armor. <laughs> but they're really good. Even Princess Peach gloves. I'm not getting on Princess Peach's case. No Always coming. talking about Princess Peach again. We can all agree this is the best look. But I'm going to get what armor I can out of the deal. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Frog wife. Okay, let's go see the dung eater again. Hey, buddy, remember when I beat your entire ass just a second ago? There you are. This dress of mourning you is not for prawn, but for you. Despite the curse stirring within you, no one has succeeded in that before. How? I thought. Then it hit me that you are, in fact, me. And I. You can't pull, the, pull this Fight Club I'm stuff. I'm not the poo poo man. I am not the poo poo man. You see this outfit? You're the poo poo man. I'm not the poo poo man. Give me your blessing. <clears throat> Defile my flesh with the seed bed curse again and again until it is done. Until a cursed ring coalesces and my one day defile order itself. Countless I have killed. And countless so have defiled, and soon the fruits will be born. Hundreds will be reborn cursed, and they'll bear thousands of cursed children, who bear tens of thousands more. A few of those will be born just like me, and they'll kill and defile and bless in my stead. The rotten fools. My fate was the grandest. Most brilliant of them all. Okay. That's... This is what happens when you eat too much poo. This is what you start talking like. Yeah. My corporeal flesh lies in the sewer jail beneath the capital. It's back in the sewer jail? Defile my flesh with a seedbed curse. Until a curse ring coalesces. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Time and time again, I've made... A YouTube video about how vaccines are bad. 
All right, we got to go back to the sewer again. Back to jail. Where is it? Where is it? Where? Where's? There it is. <laughs> uh. Time and time again, I've gotten countless neighbors to sell their makeup products. Wait, do I have souls? And be their own boss. <laughs> you are a one woman company, I say to them. Boing. Now we're going this way. Get your light on. Light your path, light your way. Excuse me, rats. Excuse me, flowers. Don't do it. We're in mourning! Oh, I like the little ones, they're cute. That noise is very funny. Don't do it. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Beware of surprise left rat and also large hand. Yeah, I'm, I'm watching out for large hand this time. I'm not going there. We're going around. This nasty fella has somehow tied himself to a chair down here. It's like you can't help but feel like you're just like playing into his nasty little hands. Because yeah. he keeps putting himself in situations and then being like, come and get me. Oh no. Oh no. I seem to be tied up. Somebody tied me to a chair. Oh no. Oh I'm so no. Weak and defenseless. Look at me, I've carved toes into my armor. <laughs> a curse. A curse. Upon them all. They'll be born cursed. All of them. Along with their children. You keep saying this, I don't care. So he's one of the people you can give Celibus's potion to. If you remember back many streams ago when Celavis gave us a potion and was like, give this to Nefeli. Mm -hmm. You can give it to Nefeli. You can also give it to the Dung Eater. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not going to be giving it to the Dung Eater, though. We're going to be cursing his ass. Curse me again, mommy. Oh, it's Goofy in the background of that Disney game. <laughs> Getting hooked. <laughs> 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 you, Golden Order. <laughs> One day, <laughs> you'll get what's coming. <laughs> One day, you'll get hooked. All right, I believe that's all we do with him right now. What, someone asked what happens if you give him the potion. Whoever you give the potion to, Celibus takes control of them and makes them into a puppet, mm. which you can then get the summon for, to summon the puppet mm. as like a spirit ash. Mm. Um, but we're not gonna be, we're not gonna be doing that at this juncture. Thank you. We're going to be giving the potion to someone else right now. We're not done with Dung Eater, right? We're not done with Dung Eater, no. Because I had a lore question about Dung Eater, but it might be spoilers for Dung Eater. We're not done with Dung Eater. Okay. I mean, you can still ask the question if you want. Is Dung Eater the character that is not actually cursed to like want to pretend like he has the curse or whatever yeah he's basically a cosplayer yeah he's like super into the cursed fandom yeah and pretends like he was part of the show the whole time he's really into the omens who are the ones that have all those horns that are cut yeah. off like margit yeah and he basically wears armor that he put all those little things on to look like he's an omen mm -hmm. but he's not He's just like a dude. He's an omen f furry. 
He is an omen furry, yeah. Wow. Hello, Gideon. You. Oh, the world's most useless father. Or stepdad. Um, I got this potion. Can you take a look at this potion for me, please? Is that potion what I think it is? Bloody Salivus. I suppose he's up to something again. Oh, I won't interfere. You go ahead and do what you must. The round table has no code to speak of. But I ask you this. Are you really going to do the bidding of that twisted dolly botherer? <laughs> or would you rather hand that potion to me and see if we can't get one over on the bastard? I don't trust anything you have to say, my dude. Listen, Gideon, I hate you, but I also hate him. And so I'm willing to work with you to spite him. And then later I will spite you. Celibus Celispis. That's right. So I'm going to give you the potion. Good. I'll dispose of the potion myself. You go and see Celibus. I'm drinking it. Don't give anything away. Just tell him that you tricked your mark into drinking the potion as planned. Despite knowing next to bloody nothing, he's so far up his own ass he won't suspect a thing. Damn. His inevitable display of arrogance will certainly be a sight to behold. So we're gonna lie to Celibus. Uh, but first, we're gonna run some ads. Your helmet, did you ever have the, the Lego helmet that you could like rotate on your little dude's head? That's what yeah. it looked like. It does look like a Lego helmet, you're right. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna run three minutes of ads real quick. Here they come. Ads are... <laughs> I wish I could see our preview window. Yeah, me too. Oh wait, it came back when you moved it. What the heck? Whoa. Whoa, we can see again. Wow, all oh we had to do was... Oh my God. Was scrunch it a little bit. This is amazing. I can see our faces. I don't. I forgot what you look like. Me too. Because I couldn't see you. Yeah. I forget what I look like if I don't look at myself all the time. What the heck? Hi, everybody. Hi, everyone. I know you could always see us, but we couldn't see us. I didn't even know that the camera's like slightly off center for no reason. And nobody told me. Nobody told me. That you had a girlfriend who looked like a girlfriend, and I had a girlfriend, and you had a girlfriend, and we had a girlfriend. And I had a girlfriend who had a girlfriend. And my girlfriend's girlfriend. She was my girlfriend. Cause she's good song. Mr. Brightside. <laughs> That's the poly version of the song. And now he's a Neve. She's back because the camera's back. Oh, Miss Olive loves being on camera. Yes, yeah, she does. She knows. <laughs> you gonna come sit with me, little buddy? OMG, Julia, that's a different song. Are you talking about um, my girlfriend had a girlfriend whose girlfriend had a girlfriend and um, my friend had a girlfriend who had a girlfriend. And that's Mr. Brightside. And that's Mr. Brightside. No, that's one song. No, that's how it goes. We just sang it. I don't know like what version you've been listening to, but like the original version. I haven't looked at Olive's belly in a while to see if it's improving at all. She Plus, has sneezed on me. So many times Every time today. she gets into your lap, she sneezes on you. She sneezes directly on my arm. Yeah. I'm covered in your snot. <laughs> and I'm tired of it. Super Bedward says, I want to let you know, Jacob, that I picked up Elden Ring and started a whole new character <laughs> because I was inspired by this run. Unfortunately, I only play on PS5. Did you like my reading? Yeah, I don't know why it was so robotic. <laughs> <laughs> But I'm glad that you are playing Elden Ring again Jacob, as a result. I just want to let you know. My husband started my husband. playing Elden Ring. <laughs> Showing my husband Elden Ring for the first time. <laughs> He's so confused. <laughs> my husband <laughs> tastes died. Elden Ring for the first time. <laughs> 
Thanks for the beautiful read, Julia. I love TikTok. You're welcome. <laughs> Showing my husband the dung eater for the very first time. He loves it. <laughs> That's me, he says. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused. What happened to Olive's belly? She she picks at her fur on her stomach. Because it had to get shaved a couple of years ago for a sonogram. And then her skin was sensitive, so she kept picking at it. Yeah. And it just never grew back. And we kept, we keep putting her in the orange and then it starts to grow back and then she picks at it again when we take the orange off. This time we're just going to leave her in the orange for as long as possible. For the rest of her life. And then... She's going to we'll, have the longest stomach fur <laughs> anyone's ever seen and she's going to be absolutely filthy. Yeah, she's going to be so gross. Uh, are the ads done? They just finished. The ads are done! <laughs> Why don't we play the game? I'm sorry, my bottle made a loud noise before, and now she's scared of this bottle. Olive, can you pick somewhere she's to She's scared. Be? I scared her again. Oh my God! Speaking of things that are scary, should we show them the Pikachu? Oh my God! Yes. Go back to webcam. So, so first of all, this past weekend, we hung out with Ansta, who was in town, which was a ton of fun. It was great to meet Ansta. And she brought us some gifts from Japan. And one of the gifts was the most cursed Pikachu I've ever seen in my life. And so you're, you need to see the cursed Pikachu as well. weird red rocket tail yeah and then it's got this weird ass like what is this what is this tail that's not what pikachu's tail looks like it doesn't auto aim remember it's only if our it does auto aim we our faces can't be showing or auto focus rather and it will eventually focus on what's closest to it there we go look at that what the hell is that that's not Pikachu's tail. And that's not that's not Pikachu's <laughs> mouth either. Pikachu's tongue is not supposed to be like that. And this isn't Pikachu's bow tie. Who is this? Can I see it? What does his belly say? Nothing that would help us in our quest to figure out what the hell this is. Can I like Anyways, back to back to the game now. Uh, oh, we, and the cats are very scared of the Pikachu. Sorry. Yeah, the cats are very scared of the Pikachu. We're going to go pay Celavis a visit. The ear is the only thing that's right. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Go, horse! Onwards to Celavis! So we're going to go lie to Celavis and tell him that we gave the potion to Nefeli. Why does he want Nefeli to drink the potion? Because he wants to turn her into a puppet. Yeah, that's super creepy. Yeah, he's a creepy dude. That deer did not give a shit about this giant horse running into it. No, because the horse is part of the natural world. Oh, see. I do like Celavis's outfit, though. Ah, so you made Nefeli drink the potion. 
Well done. You are a touch more useful than I had thought. Very well. Then you shall have your gift. Knowledge of the sorcerous arts and of the tutelage of the great preceptor Salavis. I doubt much of it will lay within the grasp of a mere tarnished, but if you put your mind to it, perhaps you won't embarrass our lady. You wish to begin right this moment? Well, your impatience, though boorish, is understandable. Let's have at it. About Nefeli. So, you had Nefeli drink the potion? Truly? Hmm. Then perhaps something was amiss with oh, hey, Joy. it. It's concocted from the finest ingredients, but perhaps I should review the recipe. Oh, I see. I may have expected too much of her to begin with. What kind of sorceries you got? Nothing good. Neat. Anyway, bye. So now we're going to uh, discover a bit of Celevis's secrets. Where am I doing that? Celevis's secrets. Did you come out because you heard the evil Pikachu? That's the wrong way. Seluvicrits, exactly. So if we go over here to these ruins... There's a secret... Tunnel? Tunnel. <gasps> secret tunnel! Secret tunnel. What? And in here we find... Some puppets. We got an omen killer puppet. Hmm. We got Stop a puppet on one of these. It's the dragon. Oh, thank you. Puppet of a little, a little, a little prin lad. princely fella. Puppet of a of <laughs> what looks to be let me solo her. Yeah, really. We got a let me solo her puppet. But then, what's this? Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel, we find a Selen puppet. What the hell? But she was cool! He's even got a puppet of Selen. And he's hiding all these puppets down here. So she got got by Selevis? Or she that's hasn't, a copy She of hasn't her. got got, he just has a puppet of her. That's so weird. So now we need to go confront Celevis about this, about what we've seen. And it's got lady puppets. I guess I'm a boy puppet, so he's a weirdo. He got all sorts of puppets. He's got all sorts of puppets. He's a, he's a bit of a puppet man. Listen, Glintstone, Dragon, Adula, no offense. Sing me a song, you're a puppet man. But I have no interest in fighting you. Do you think he has a Megan? From the, the new hit movie, Megan? Yeah, the new uh, greatest movie ever, Megan. Probably. Uh, Salavis. What's What's been going on? We have a word. My man. Begging for another lesson so soon. Ugh, there remains much to be done. Make it quick. Begging for another No, I want to talk to you. No, I want to talk to you about... Was there a... There was a shiny thing in there? Did I not get the thing I needed? Am I stupid? Am I the stupid one? Did I not get the thing? What? Just horsing around. It's okay, Miss Adev. It's just a truck. I know, it sounds like a big monster. Torrent's like... Mm. <laughs> I don't know about this.
I saw something in the back on the right, like next to the door. There it is. That thing. Ah, this. This is what I needed. Yeah. The thing that says Celibus' puppet, do not touch. And, you know, then a, and then a Celibus comes out and stands a there. A creepy man who has a doll collection would have <laughs> that, that sort of like, no girls allowed, do not touch. Oh, the fact that there's a bed there. Come on. I know, that's even worse. What does that message say on the bed? Time for sleep. Eh, I don't think so. Okay, let's try again. Do not touch my doll collection. It's special. It's a special. I've it's worked mine. very hard on it. It was very expensive. Don't sully them with your peasant's fingers. <laughs> Only I know how to treat the dolls correctly. <laughs> They're limited edition. They're limited edition. Handcrafted. Now Wait then. Uh, did you see my cool sign with me on it? <laughs> About I got the inspiration from Death Stranding. About your chambers. You break into a man's private chambers, <laughs> looting about as you please. Do you see us? Your officialness knows no bounds. Fine and well. You tricked Nefeli and had her drink the potion. I believe that makes you my accomplice. You yearn for a puppet of your own. Well, normally one of your stature would never be allowed. But perhaps I can make a very special exception. Now, choose. So he's got two puppets here, Finger Maiden Theralina oh God. and Jar White, who we saw this, pu we saw both these puppets in the, down there in the puppet cave. So we're gonna take Jar White. Oh, you have 6909 runes. And then we have to get Starlight shards. Do I have any starlight shards? I don't think I would. I think we need like five starlight shards. I'm gonna have to look up the locations of them. Star shart shart light shart light shards. You break into a man's doll chamber. <laughs> Touch his dolls. Touch his dolls and then ask him what is up with the dolls. <laughs> ask him why he has so many dolls. That look like people you've met. How, How rude. Incredibly rude. Starlight. I think the one in the wrong here is actually you and not me. Starlight shards. See how I'm deflecting the blame. Star starlight shards. There's 11 in a ruins. You just got to kill the boss to get them. Should be one in a crater on Mount Gelmir. We're not going to Mount Gelmir yet. I got to look up where starlight shards are. And we got to go get them. You know, on one of these streams, I talked about how my parents woke me up at 4.30 in the morning to go on a random trip to Vermont to get pancakes and then come back. Um, the other story with my parents being weirdos in the middle of the night is that one day I woke up and the way that my old bedroom was situated was that my bed was against the wall that like the door was also on. So if you look like towards your feet, you would see like, if anyone were to come in, they would like turn to their right and then they would be looking at you if you were in the bed. One time I woke up, it was the middle of the night, and my whole family was standing in my now open doorway with the light coming in from the hallway, and they start singing, Good morning, starshine. The earth says hello. Uh, and then they all uh, giggled and sprinted away. What the hell? And they thought that was the funniest thing. And then a couple of minutes later, my dad came in, stepped in, did a long step, came in, and then pulled the door closed. And then I... I had to decide if I was supposed to get out of bed or not. Mysteries abound. My parents are people who um, partake in no substance substances. My dad very lightly drinks, like a beer occasionally, but that's it. 
And at this time, my dad didn't drink at all. So this was just a decision they made. They were very overworked for a while. <laughs> I think this was one of those moments. So there's one, like, over here. Y'all do whatever you want down there. I'm not... Yeah. But I never grab this grace. Do a little grace grab. Do a little grace grab while we're here. Yeah, it would be nice. If I could touch this grace. Nice. It's up there. It's up there. All right, here, there's one. I need more. I need more shards. Hello. I'm looking at, at a map. He's looking at a map. Were they theater kids? God, no. We gotta go. There's one over, over around here. Over around these parts. I didn't mean to drink that juice. <laughs> juice enough, just that in case. That was accidental juice. Accidental juicing. When I juice on purpose, you'll know. Because every time you juice, you go, I'm juicing! I'm juicing over here! I'm juicing over here! Excuse me, everybody. Excuse me, I'm just riding through. Pardon me. I'm just, I'm just here for the shards. The starlight shards. Please. Thank you. Is anybody mad at me? No, no one is mad You're at me. You're fine. They saw how I'm dressed and they were like... I don't want to mess with that. I'm not doing it. Okay, next shard, next shard. Okay, I see. I see. I see exactly where it is. I can see exactly where it is. Oh, it's there. It's over near here. It's over near here. Don't you worry. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. It's like, it's like over here somewhere. Oh, no. It's up. It's up higher. It's that? up higher. Oh, my God. Jacob? Jacob, can you grab the chair? Oh my god, Miss Alive! Just step up on it. She clawed my back. I'm gonna let you step up on it. Oh. Thanks, Olive. Listen, if you can't take the claws, don't have the cat. That's what I always say. Yeah. So windy. Yeah, it's the Storm Hill. Oh, it's the freaking Storm Hill, okay? Do you think that they named it Storm Hill because it was stormy or yes. because or because they felt like they had to storm the hill? No. And they were like the only way you are getting up this hill is if you storm it. No. We're storming up the hill. No. I think it was it's the first thing you said <laughs> cuz it's Literally constantly storming on this hill. Hey! You fucked up. <laughs> you fucked up, bro. All bats do is screech. Anyone else? You Are you going? Are you going away? He's like, I don't really Have you realized the error of your ways? Okay, what's that? Three shards? We need two more shards. Two more. Okay, we got that one. We got that one. Chat, you can't play baseball here. There's no thunder. 
There's only wind. Northeast Kalid, close to the bestial sanctum. Show me. Wow. That is close to the bestial sanctum. You're not lying. Hey, this website, they know their stuff. They ain't lying on this website. They ain't lying on this website. Well, you can't put lies on the website, Jacob. You it's, know this. It's on the internet. It's on the internet. You can't post it there unless it's true. Everybody be fact checking. Hello, beast clergyman. Hello, gargoyle that <laughs> oh, stands not, out here. You're not going to give me... Okay, that's fine. Just use the... the <laughs> Grace or whatever. Gargoyle's like the worst guard of all time. <laughs> yeah. Just run right by him. Boing, boing. It's okay, Black Blade Kindred. I'm not gonna fight you. We're cool. Just gonna touch that. Not oh. run off the cliff. We're gonna come over here. Scary. Get the shards. Okay, one more, one more shard. Damn, you out in this rain with your exposed back. It's strong. The Church of the Plague. You gonna get a cult. The church, the, the church. Church of the Plague. The plague did a lot of praying in 2020, am I right? Oh, got too strong. Holy moly. That is so, that is too true, bestie. Too true. Right, it's like. Where's the plague? Where's the church of social distancing? Am I right? Where's the church of masking up? You are I so, right? you are so right. Let me tell you. Where's the church of. Get a vaccine. Make sure it's boosted. All right, you're, you're losing me a little bit. It's getting a little too preachy for me, okay? Where's the church at? Shut the fuck up, my Yeah, right? where's that church? I should ask you. Hi, Joey. Hi, sweetie. Okay, I think we're sharded up. I think we're all sharded up and ready to go. Now we go back to Rani's Rise. Him. <clears throat> that was brutal. Julia said it. Who said what? The church is shutting the fuck up. Jacob, you can't say that on the stream. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Hi, Joy. We sharded up that hill. Sharded up the hill. Sharded up on God. <laughs> Started on a building. I'll just keep shutting in my pants. Shutting on your floor. <laughs> shutting on your children. <laughs> <laughs> hey. If I only could. <laughs> 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 Hello, Salivus. Salivus. You got a load of this. I think I'm, I might have to quit out. That's what your mask looks like. <laughs> In a little preview. <laughs> Jacob is becoming the poo poo man. <laughs> No, Jacob's not becoming the dung eater. He's becoming the dung doer. Yeah, I'm becoming the the shart doer. You need to buy all of his spells first. You have to buy all his spells. What? Begging for another letter. No, I don't. I want a new puppet. You absolute chat? fools. Chat? The absolute foolishness I'm seeing You're in chat right internet. now. You're on the internet. You can't be spreading lies. Freaking embarrassing. Embarrassing. You're an embarrassment. Le Why don't you learn something? Why don't you read a book? Apologize. Why don't you study a book? 
Write me a letter. Write me a letter. And apologize. Watch that. You want another puppet? <laughs> Quite the keen paramour, aren't we? But I'm afraid each and every one is like a child to me. I can hardly just give them away. Oh dear, what's to be done? Why don't you fetch me some starlight shards? If you can manage it, I'll gladly prepare a new puppet for you. Boy, oh, do the I soul of every you. puppet has its own ambience. You'll soon come to know once you possess a few. And once each is predilections are known to you, the better you will be able to love them. Oh yes, you have much to look forward to further down this road. This is I like, just really love to hear myself talk. When you talk to someone about their like fucked up hobby <laughs> and they yeah. like mistakenly think that you also want to get into it. Maybe if I go into enough <laughs> details, he'll convert. And, and I'm like, no, that's not. I was just making convert. I didn't mean I didn't mean that I wanted to get into it, especially not when you call me a keen paramour when I say I want a new puppet. <laughs> Uh, we've been called worse things in this game, like uh, well, that's just like Lampkin. him outright saying he fucks the puppets. Mm -hmm. He's like, you want a new puppet? What a lover you are! Uh, not one puppet, not enough for you. Uh, this dude's a puppet fucker. Uh, Anyways, let's buy a puppet to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even need as many starlight shards as I got. I only needed two. Damn. Yeah, give me this. Veronina. You're proving to be quite the puppeteer. I've not had an apprentice for a very long time indeed. You still don't. I'm not your apprentice. How's the puppet I gave you? A thing of exquisite craft, is it not? Don't talk to me. About the scheme. Mm. Hey, Celibus, I heard you had a scheme. Can you tell us about the scheme? A pyramid scheme, Celibus. Perhaps you'd be interested in a little... Scheme. Oh, God, he impaled himself on my sword. Oh. Don't get closer to me! Which I aspire to cherish with these very... You know he's got that cheeto breath. Yeah. Even Lady Rani. How does that sound? I do not want to try to fool Lady Rani. But I'm interested for the sake of uh, conversation. I knew I had you pegged. No, you don't. don't. No, you don't. Like me. no, I'm not. Then I'd like you to procure something. I don't want to. A rather unique starlight shard that glistens with amber. With that, my special draft will gleam with nectar sweetness. And even a demigod would be slave to its charms. About amber starlight. Procure it for me. <laughs> the unique starlight shard that glistens with amber. With that, my special draft will gland even a Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he wants to make Ronnie into a puppet now, is what he wants to do. Dude loves powerful women and loves to be in control of them. That's so normal. Oh, God, so normal. So we're gonna go get his amber crystals. Amber crystals. Joy's just sprinting. We gotta go to the Altus Highway Junction. <laughs> Joy is running, running about. Olive's going Olive to is run going with her. to run. The things men will do instead of going to therapy. Make puppets. Make so many puppets. Of actual people he knows. So we're probably just going to finish this like Celibus bit. I guess that'll probably be the last thing we do. Yeah, let's rid ourselves of uh, Celibus for as long as possible by getting it all done now. We got to get we got to get down in this in this crotter. Hello, Crotter. How do I get down? The problem is I can't freaking see. Crotter, make it be daylight. How do I get down in this damn Crotter? I was born in the Crotter. Molded by it. 
I feel like if I if I drop in here, I'm gonna die, right? Probably. I kind of feel like I can do a little shimmy shimmy down these rocks. Do a little shimmy shimmy. Look at that. You lived, bitch. <laughs> My little shimmy shimmy. And then we can snag ourselves the amber starlight. Amber starlight. Then we go back again. Really wish they would have put the freaking Grace, put a Grace inside of Celibus's rise. Uh... Even Grace didn't want to be there. If Grace yeah. was there, Celibus would have turned it into a freaking puppet. Yeah, you're right. And then, you know, did his did his way with it. We don't want him to do that. <clears throat> so we're we're not going to be administering I'll tell you right now, we're not going to be administering this potion to Ronnie. No. You can do it if you want. And then, but then you have to like go to the turtle pope and request absolution in order to continue Ronnie's quest line. I don't want to confess that kind of thing to the turtle pope. And I'm pope, not okay? telling the turtle pope that I did that. Turtle pope would be like. So soon. Ugh, there remains much to be done. Make it quick. Nothing is heresy. Nothing is heresy. Except what you did Except just there. That shit, That's pretty nasty. I thought nothing was heresy, but now I'm having to rethink my whole worldview. Yeah, Ronnie kills you if you try and give it to her. Well, well. Good for Ronnie. You managed to. Everyone should be more like Ronnie. The blessed day is finally upon us. Goodness gracious, the way it glistens. Utterly enchanting. To think this was oh, once nasty. a demigod's very fate. My, oh my, <clears throat> oh my. Anyways. Ah. <laughs> Are you still here? Oh, God. Oh, yes, I, I should give you your reward. Yeah, please. It's all yours. It's splendid work. It's just marvelous. <laughs> Thank you for the charm. Just you wait. The merriment is soon to begin. That Just charm looks like something you get out of in these tiger films. Very shortly. All right. So now that we have the charm, we're basically done with Celibus. Yeah. <clears throat> and this means. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I know. It was hard. It was hard. This means we can finally go and uh, and talk to Ronnie and give her the Finger Slayer Blade, the one that we went all the way down into the eternal city of Nakron to retrieve so that she can kill a god. And this is the wrong way. Who said Nakron in the cool way? Nakron. Nakron. I think it was Blythe. So we are going to go and give Ronnie the Finger Slayer Blade. Give her the finger. We're gonna give Ronnie the finger. You should walk up to her and be like, I got your finger blade right here. Hey! hey! No, but seriously, it's here. Please don't kill me. We're gonna show up and she's gonna be like, what happened to you? That was EG. Who says no? You did not look like this last time I saw you. She's <laughs> gonna be like, um, a little bit of a fashion choice, <laughs> have you okay. Have you been through some shit? <laughs> Hi, Ronnie. Ah, it was thee. It was me. Not blithe, it seemeth. Even in my slumber, I sensed it. It is in thy possession, is it not? The hidden treasure of Nokron. Oh, I just noticed my her, like, thanks. white face Finally, is talking. All the oh, no, both are Yeah, they're both talking. Soon oh. must I begin my journey. Upon the dark path only I may tread. I would love to help you go on the dark path that only you may tread. Uh, Ronnie, we got a lot of stuff to tell you. But before I leave... I must entrust thee with this. Take it. Thank you for the carrion inverted statue. Thank you so much. Great. My discarded flesh lieth beyond the seal unlocked by it, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. upon which is carved the curse mark of thy desire. Mm -hmm. I can fathom what thy purpose might be. Mm. Neither of us is welcomed by the brighter path. I see. You may leave now. It was but brief. 
But thou gavest me fine service. What is it? Thy purpose in approaching me was to obtain the curse mark, was Can we it tell not? her about Sullivan's? You made she knows. Now. Oh, okay. I too am to depart on a jerk. What is it? Thy purpose. Okay. She knows in the way that like all women know, you know? Well, she knows even more than that, because we're about to go back to Zelovus. Okay. We're going to go back to Zelovus and discover uh, how much she knew. And how much he done goofed? And how much he done goofed. All right. Ride my horse to Selefis. I'm gonna see his corpse on the tower floor. <laughs> no. I'm peace. Sometimes you just gotta give it a try, you know, and see like what comes yeah. out. Yeah. In episodes, we like edit those bits out. Actually, no, <laughs> we usually like make a bit about how much, uh, you know, you messed up the bit. Hey, Celevis. Good. It's finally complete. Give it to I mean, I'll take that. Doll, so she might dip I'll, her. I'll take that from you. About you, the draft. You know, back up. Understand, don't you? Mm. That once you have Rani drink my draft, my scheme will come to fruition. And mm. we... Well... We just imagine... I will not imagine the pure elation. Now, I don't remember here if I need to refresh or if I need to do another thing first, so I'm going to do a quick quit out, just in case. Oh, I think I might have to do one more thing first. Let's do it. Let's wrap it all up. Yeah, and then we'll be done with Celevis we for good. We have a light work week this week. Yeah. Uh, well, we got a man down over here. Bum, 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 bum. We got a pervert down over here. Ronnie knew. Oh, I love his his abhorsen cloak. Ronnie knew. Ronnie knew a lot, but there's something curious about the way Celavis is sitting. Oh, isn't he sitting like one of his puppets? He's sitting like one of his puppets, which is curious. Is he a puppet? So why don't we go and visit Pitya again? Did he don't make a puppet of himself? The servant who was working in the, the workshop. I am suspicious. Someone getting hit? Um. This is one of my favorite little uh, little visuals here. You'll especially like it, Julia. Oh. Here we find Pitya, surrounded by his puppets. I pity the fool. Damn. Good. So as it turns out, it's uh, very likely that Celavus was a puppet the entire time. Mm. And that Pitya was the one controlling all of the puppets. Well. But I love how spooky this is. Yeah. Because you don't get to see them do anything. And they don't ever move again. Well, it's very like Majora's Mask. With like the statues that move without your your seeing them. Yeah. You know. That's very good. Just really cool. Didn't expect betrayal. That's great. Yeah, I think that's like one of my favorite Elden Ring moments. Yeah, I I loved it when I saw this the first time. I was like, ooh, kind of gives me little chills. Mm -hmm. 
because we don't know why the puppets rose up and but it also implies a deeper horror yeah that the puppets still retain some sort of oh yeah themselves Ooh. like the puppets still are like have some awareness which makes it even worse like the cybermen the cybermen the cybermen of um doctor who oh i don't know doctor who the the uh the people get converted into into robots but uh eventually you learn that sometimes they retain their they retain their brain they just can't control anything they got a they got a brain retain yeah hello well we've got two cats here who are looking for some play they sure are um I literally have one more thing to do, and we're actually done with this entire Kalid. Oh, let's do it then. Segment. All right. So we're just going to go ahead and do that real fast. All we have to do is talk to Nefeli. Now that all this celibus business is done with, mm -hmm. and we're in no danger of potioning her, uh, I see that someone is rating the Sovereign sequel rated. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Uh, we're actually just finishing up, unfortunately, but... Uh, appreciate it nonetheless. Ah, you. Please, leave me be. It's pathetic, I know, but I... I need to think. It's not pathetic. I heard from Gideon. So you know already, do you? Right. It's true. My father cast me out for indulging my emotions. Forgetting the mission. Punishment for offing his pawns. Father, mother, Lord Gideon has offered me guidance all my life. I would have done anything for him, to place him on the throne of Elden Lord. And yet I, though it was not my intent, I betrayed him. And I can no longer trust him, Father, to think he'd order his men to enact such tragedy. Where is the justice he purports in that? He once told me that if he became Elden Lord, he would never allow the downtrodden to be cheated ever again. Was he simply lying to me? Very, yes. Very politician of He him. was lying to you. No, no, no. How could I say that? Father has always given me his guidance. And now, I've lost it. <laughs> Draz says, I love that this stream is about three shittiest men in this game. Yeah, pretty much. Um, so you'll remember back in the uh, when we went back to the starting area, we got that Stormhawk Stormhawk King mm -hmm. Ash. Mm -hmm. This is what it was for to give to Nefeli at this oh. moment. I can smell the ancient storm in it. My thanks. I'll gladly take it. I'm not like Broderica. I don't feel the presence of spirits, let alone see them. Still. This ash, it reminds me of my first hawk. Thank you. You're so welcome. In this ash, I can smell the ancient storm. It reminds me of my first hawk. In this ash, it reminds me of my first hawk. All right, and that's where we leave Nefeli for now. We've given her the Stormhawk King, thus allowing her to continue on, even though her dad sucks. Mm hmm Everyone's saying to Feli, look at this cool bird, take it. I know your dad sucks, but have some ash. Your I dad mean, may suck, but cool bird. If I were going through like a rough time and someone walked up and handed me something called the Stormhawk King, I'd be like, maybe this isn't so rough after all. Yeah. At least I got this This thing. actually kind of rips. Uh, anyways, that's going to be the end of this where we finished the, um, the Kalid Altus segment here. Uh, on the next one, we'll be starting into Mount Gelmir. So get ready for some Gelmir. That's no mere mountain. It's no mere mountain. It's no mere Geller, Ross Geller. Ross Geller mountain. Anyways. That's it. We'll be back on Sunday with a different game since we finished up uh you know betrayal at club low yeah and then trophy stream on monday that's correct um so. also 
Uh, me and Nathan might do a Marvel Snap stream um, either tomorrow or Friday. Whoa! We just were texting about it earlier, so I don't know for sure, but we'll we'll let you know if that's the case. Hell yeah. Do it, man. Uh, okay, that's it. Bye, everybody. Goodbye. See you later.